Clover. What's up, Money Geeks? Mr. V here. Welcome to another video, guys. So in this video, we are going to talk about Clover Health, which is a, a health insurance company that went public um, last January or this past January, um, again, with uh, investor uh, Shamat. So it went through a spark. One of his spark actually took Clover Health public. So in this stock had um, taken a beating at one point because our Hindenburg Research put out um, a kind of like a, a hit piece on them and that actually tanked the stock. So, and then for some reason, the stock is right now uh, really popping again. And it, the stock has been going up about 183% in the last five days. So that's what I want us to cover in today's video. But before we get started, guys, if you're new to the channel, we talk about how to earn money, how to save money, how to invest and build wealth. So if that's something that interests you, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss out on new content. Again, guys, the purpose of this video is not to tell you what Clover Health does. Um, basically, it's a health insurance company, um, do a lot of stuff with Medicare. So um, they went public and for the most part, investors were excited about it because it was being led by uh, one of the charismatic investor on Wall Street, Shamar. Um, as a matter of fact, he's like the face of Spark for some reason. But um, after, after, after they went public, um, Hindenburg Research came out and published a, a kind of a report on Clover Health and really called the business out that they were lying about their numbers, lying about their, their, their user base. And so the stock actually took a massive beating. So it actually plunged the stock. And then now the stock has actually, in the past uh, five days, as you can see here, it's up about 184%. So the question is, why is the stock popping? If we go back here just about a month ago, look at the stock. The thing was sitting at about six, seven dollars at one point. And so after Hindenburg Research published their 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 report, um, a lot of people on Wall Street shorted the stock. So it was highly, highly shorted. The short interest on this was high. So we can switch over here. As you can see, they are currently number two in the list of high short interest stocks over 20 percent. They are currently number two. And so that is how uh, a lot of people on Reddit and on these all these other platforms are now now coming together and pushing um, you no know, Clover just like they did with with GameStop, uh, with AMC and all these other meme stocks. Clover Health is actually on that path right now. So if we go back here, um, just just today alone or the last five days is up one hundred eighty four percent. And then today, as I'm recording this video, it was up 85%. So again, this is things that we don't see. It's not because of the fundamentals. Um, it's just because of the fact that the stock was highly shorted. And then uh, Reddit guys decided that, uh, no, nope, we don't want that. So they're, they're squeezing the stock to the upside. They're forcing all these people on Wall Street to try to cover their positions because if they don't, they're going to end up losing uh, a boatload of money. So that's why uh, you see um, Clover Health actually popping. Again, because the fact that the fundamentals haven't changed, in my personal opinion, if you're trading um, this, if there's profit in there, secure that profit before chasing more. So if you are in the money, make sure that whatever you have, you have maybe kind of a, a trailing stop or maybe a, a stop loss to take some of that profit and then you can keep chasing more. So because it's not based on fundamentals, it's just based on the fact that uh, there's a short squeeze going up on this stock. And so it's it's fun to take advantage of the situation. If you're not trading it, uh, it's up to you. So if you have a little bit of cash sitting around, throw it in there. Um, and see where it goes. I mean, for me, what I normally do is I would go in, make profit, and then I can take some of that profit or just leave a little bit of the profit in there so that if it squeeze and go to $50, $60, $70, um, I'm, I should be good. If it makes like it wants to pull back, I can cut my losses and get out and be happy. But at that point, I'm playing with house money and not my own money. So if you make money, use that to play uh, the game and not just sit there. Because I've seen a lot of people that are saying like, hey, just buy and hold, don't sell. And I'm thinking like, you can say that, 
Uh, but when it comes at the end of the day, everybody is responsible for their own money. This is not a group thing. You guys need to work together and put your money in the pool and decide that you're going to go out and invest it. So if somebody went out and bought the stocks and you tell them, they're like, oh, don't sell it. Hold, hang, hang on to it. It's like, I don't, I don't know if you, you have that power to control somebody and tell them when to sell and when not to sell. But again, that's just my personal opinion. So that's what I want us to cover in this video. Clover Health is on the move and it's still moving. Um, again, we can see here, like I said, the last five days, 184%, which is insane. So we hope that if this thing can squeeze all the way to uh, 40, 50 bucks and join um, AMC, that would be awesome. So again, let me know what you guys think about this. Did you trade Clover Health or are you trading Clover Health? Or do you have it in your portfolio? If yes, let me know again in the comment section what you plan on doing. If you're new to the channel, we talk about how to earn money, how to save money, how to invest and build wealth. So if that's something that interests you, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss out on new content. Also, guys, if you are looking to get started with investing, Weibo has their promotion right now where if you sign up and deposit $100, you get some free stocks, no cost to you. Links in the description below. And as always, guys, do your due diligence. Don't be a greedy savage and stay motivated.